how do we undo that compaction in the soil? Beetles. Beetles. Yeah. Roots. Roots, that, yeah. that effect of the roots. So a tree root will just be continually putting pressure on that soil and eventually break the pot that it's in. But what about that grass? Each time you graze it, some of that roots may be going to die back, it's going to reorganize its root system and it's going to go down again. So it's a pulsing action, like a very slow uh, jackhammer that's doing it. But most importantly, that plant that we see right now, if we let some sunlight onto it, so it can do its job there, thank you, it's releasing sugars into the soils around those roots. But they will be creating the soil structure around those roots. And so that's what we're encouraging into here, is more sugars going into the soil. So more green leaf for a total period of the year. That's why he must stay away from just too long a recovery yep. period now, or just sabbathing this paddock as it is now, yep. because the growth phase and the sugar pumping into the soil will be for a very short space of time and it'll dry off. The fact that that's been grazed and then grazed again and grazed again has made it stool and has, that means make more little growth clones and it has produced more green leaf and it's currently an active green plant.